Yo, you could you could do do no, do what you want to do. My vibe is good. <laughs> so we just came from the party. Oh my god, it was so much fun. Did you have fun? Oh my goodness, look what you did. Today we are headed to the gym. Y'all know we go to the gym every single Friday. So today, instead of going to Orange Theory, we're actually headed to Planet Fitness. And um, yeah, we're gonna get some good work in. Make sure you're following us on Instagram in order to see some of that workout inspiration. Um, also just posted a fitness video. The second one might be out by the time you guys see this. So uh, just make sure you're checking out our fitness videos on this channel my whole journey about being pescatarian and my whole fitness journey y'all my clothes starting to fit better I'm starting to feel better I just got more energy it's like 9 in the morning and I'm all hyped up like I'm ready for the gym so let's get it greetings everyone a long time no talk to you. so I am headed out the door um what time is it? it's like 4 15 and y'all know we went to work out earlier and now I'm trying to make sure I got everything. I'm headed out the door actually on my way to, I need to pick up all three of the kids and I also need to go to Target and I need to go to the, I need to go somewhere. The post office, I need to go to the post office. So I'm headed out of the door right now. Y'all, I think our lazy ass postal service, I don't think they've been delivering our mail because the car was kind of right in front of the mailbox. And what they do is they stay in the car and they just put the mail in the box. So with our car in front of the mailbox, I guess they couldn't do that. They would have had to get off the car. And I seriously don't think they've been delivering our mail all week because we ain't got mail all week since the car been sitting there and then we moved it just to like test it out and lo and behold did we get mail today so i don't think they've been delivering our mail but anywho i got the keys so yeah i think i got everything yeah i'm headed to do all of that I might have to go pick up the kids before I get a chance to do everything, but I lost four pounds, so I'm really excited, but I think I'm going to cheat a little bit today. I want some fried fish. Like, I just wanna go buy some fried fish and french fries, and that's what I feel like I'm going to do. Don't try to stop me. It's too late. It's already in my mind. Girls. Where are we at? See, I got my little wine sample here. I deserve this. It's pretty cool. What's up, you guys? We just left Olive Garden. And now we're on our way to Target. I just decided to take the kids out to eat. I don't didn't feel like cooking. I wanted some fried fish, but... I don't know. I didn't feel like going to any other like hood spots to get some good fried fish. So I just said forget it and we ended up just going to Olive Garden. Yeah. And so now we're on our way to Target. I don't know if I mentioned it, but I signed them up for dance class. And so they have dance class in July and then it's like a trial run in July. The full program is from September to May. So this July is just kind of like a trial run but they need leotards and they also need ballet shoes. So we're headed to Target to see if they have any of the leotards and ballet shoes. And if they don't, I'm gonna have to go somewhere tomorrow and see if I can find tomorrow. some. Got one. These look cute. Yeah, I 
This one's a seven or eight. Oh, this is a four or five. This is Ryan's size. Good morning, you guys. It is 10.54 on Saturday and 10.54 a.m. obviously and I just got film finished filming. I filmed two videos this morning so I'm being super accomplished right now. Filmed two videos and the kids are still asleep winning all right hashtag winning um, i'm sure they're gonna wake up any minute now though so i need to go in here and clean off this counter and start to make them some breakfast i also need to bleach some knots for the wig i'm gonna put on later because hubby and i are going on date night we got a kid free night tonight so um i'm gonna drop the boy off around 5 30 ish at his nana's house and my mom's actually gonna come and pick up the girls and yeah that's what we're gonna do so we got a date night i have no idea what we're doing mark is surprising me okay this is what he told me he told me i couldn't wear a dress he told me that i needed to bring a sweater and wear long sleeves but I can still be cute like I can still wear makeup and stuff but he said no dress and bring a sweater so I'm like well dang should I wear a wig like is it gonna come off should I make sure it's pinned down good like what is gonna go oh I don't know but I'm really excited to see um, you guys know one of our our 2019 goals was to have a new experience every single month and we alternate a uh, month and i actually dropped the ball on last month i missed last month it was so hectic and crazy so um i gotta think of something good for next month but yeah i'm excited so uh yeah i'm just gonna clean off this counter for these girls when they wake up and i need to do some dishes too so let's get started before i get started cleaning up and everything i wanted to show you guys this order i got from growth collaborative because i did get some stuff come in or have some stuff come in um just a couple days ago and i'm just now getting around to opening it and putting it away and for those of you who don't know what growth collaborative is basically um it's a free website where you sign up and they can send you like cleaning products every month there is no like monthly fee or anything so what i do is i just empty out my cart every month because they'll like fill your cart up with stuff they think you need but i just empty my cart out every month if i don't want anything and i haven't gotten anything in a while because we've been super stocked on cleaning products but they have the best selection of like natural cleaning products and then they also have like when mrs myers comes out with newer scents or something they get those first i find then my target or whatever so i love to shop at growth collaborative there's always a link down below in the description box for growth collaborative so you can sign up again it's completely free you don't have to buy anything it's just i mean if you see some cleaning products that you want if you're running low order it and they'll ship it to you and the prices are usually better than what i see at my target they were having a little deal and we were running low so i ended up making an order and i only got i thought i only got a few things <laughs> I got a couple of things. Let me see. You know what? Another thing I love about them is how they ship your products with this tape over the opening so it doesn't spill like all in the box if something's wrong with the packaging. So that's, I love that. Um, so the first thing I have, oh, the mint dish soap. Mint has become like my favorite scent from Mrs. Myers. So I ended up picking up the uh, dish soap in mint and then another one of the multi-surface everyday cleaners. And this is another Mrs. Myers cleaner in mint, which I love. I also picked up one of the Method all-purpose um, surface cleaners. And this one's in the shade, what is this, Crisp Apple, I think? Yeah, this is in the scent Honey Crisp Apple. And this is one of my favorite, well, one of my first natural cleaners that I ever tried. And I kind of fell in love with natural cleaners after trying this. So I always seem to go back to my Method all-purpose cleaner. Um, I picked up this seventh generation uh, free and clear dish liquid so it's just another dish soap and these what did I get oh these were the free items so for free for ordering with the deal that they had um, they always have some kind of free deal too so always check that on their site if you're gonna purchase but I just got this glass bottle so you can mix concentrates and, and other cleanser or cleaners and everything in here or 
oh you can also put put dish soap and hand soap in this as well so that's that and then oh oh i forgot about this so this is the gel dish soap. Put it in this glass bottle and use it. And I think we're almost out of the dish soap that we have, so I made do that today. That makes me excited. All right, let me clean off this counter and then I need to do some dishes. I need to start the girls' breakfast. Let's, let's just get started. We got a lot of stuff to do. talk to so it is um 6 25 in the evening and i'm just waiting on mark to finish getting ready so we can head out to our date um today i've just really been cleaning up and um got me a new wig on so i've been getting that together but yeah we're getting ready to go on our date so i'm wearing this like low cut shirt and mark is like no that ain't gonna work for whatever we do it so i have to put a jacket on top of this and i have to wear closed toe shoes what are we doing and i he told me yeah i have to put a jacket on i have to wear closed toe shoes my shoes will not get dirty so we're we must not be outside he said my tennis shoes will not get dirty um and whatever we're doing it's going to take an hour and it's close by and then we can come back and finish getting dressed and i'm like well i'm already dressed so i didn't even put any lashes on because i'm like am I, is my lashes gonna come off do i need to like put an extra bobby pin in my wig like what are we doing so i'm just waiting on him to finish up and then we're gonna head out and of course i'll take you guys with us so we are on our way out this is my month i'm actually you know planning so we doing this thing if you guys know go video the Cadillac right. goal video coming soon but we'll talk about that but one of our goals was to do a new experience every month and see how she walks away because she never does her experience in the month that she's supposed to be doing it another rule just came like, up it was not a rule if you would have yes, it, it would have been fine another I'm rule just, just came up <laughs> I can't wear jewelry I did not say that you could not wear jewelry I did but not, he ain't got no jewelry he always wears jewelry and I was like I forgot my <laughs> ring and he was like oh that's okay you had to take it off anyway Guess down below. Let me know what y'all think we doing. I mean, they can guess it. I think they will be able to. I don't think you will because you wouldn't be thinking about something like this. I think they will, from the stuff that I've told you, they would know exactly where we're going. And it's like, it's something I've never done, so it can't be like zip lining or anything because I've done that a million times. I couldn't wear a dress. I forgot to tell y'all that. I said it would be recommended if you don't wear a dress. I didn't say you couldn't. It so would probably be recommended if you did not wear a dress. That's what I'm just saying. That's what I said. I said it'd be recommended. I didn't say you couldn't. You could have if you wanted to. It's recommended that you don't. Okay, so we made it here and we are at the gun range, at the shooting range. I've never shot a gun before. So that's why he was saying he nervous. I have a thing with guns. I don't really like them. So, we shall see how this goes. Don't 
be nervous. So, we just came back from the gun range, as you guys saw, pretty fun. Like I said, I've never shot a gun before. I'm actually kind of terrified of guns. But um, that was actually a lot of fun. I actually didn't do too shabby. Did I? No. This is not for the first time you ever shot a gun. I ain't no killer, but don't push me. I don't know about all that. <laughs> <laughs> no, it was fun though. I was telling him, I was like, it's amazing how comfortable you can get with anything. Like, when I first went in there, I don't know what he was shooting it next to us. A 22. Oh my God. Guns. So he was like, um, like when I first walked in, the first thing you hear is pop. And I'm like, oh my God, what the fuck? <laughs> what is that? I mean, I knew what it was, but it was just like, and then you just keep hearing it. And then all of a sudden, I'm like, it's amazing how comfortable, how can you get so comfortable with gunfire? But clearly you can. Um, but yeah, that was a lot of fun. I've always wanted to go to the gun range. I just, I don't know, it makes me nervous. Well, made me nervous, because it was it was a lot of fun. We are just out uh, grabbing something to eat. Out here at our favorite restaurant. Mario! You ain't got no ring on it? I always got mine on though. So, uh, we're trying to go get um, CC's tattoo. Have you guys ever seen my tattoo up close? So, I got... CC's initial, not even her marriage initial tattoo on my finger, my, my ring finger. So, CC was supposed to get this done like six years ago when I got mine, but still not done yet. So, we were going to do that, but all the tattoo shops was closed. So, um, yeah, we just all grabbed something to eat um, and seeing where the night goes. Yeah, we were about to go get a tattoo, but they were all closed. It was like eight something, so we might just go tomorrow and get this tattoo. But um, I can't wait to eat these tacos because I am star, like starving, starving, starving. And I don't know, again, like he said, I don't know what we're about to do for the rest of the night, but we to go to a party y'all we met out in a minute like that to go to a party so i think we're about to head to a party somebody i know is hosting an all r&b party so it's all r&b songs and i heard the parties be pretty lit so uh, we're about to head over there now and see what it's hitting for only problem is the party is like 45 minutes from where we live which sucks we can't get too drunk because clearly we have to drive home so that just kind of sucks that it's so far but i think it's going to be a lot of fun and i'm excited we always be like we hardly ever go out but no we go out we hardly ever go out to like parties and stuff like this so i think it's just going to be a whole lot of fun much fun did you have fun oh my goodness look what you did <laughs> oh you are so drunk <laughs> no i'm not but you just threw my camera i didn't throw your camera one oh my goodness yes you did you're so <laughs> i can tell you drunk by the way you're talking how am i talking I like you threw I, my camera i didn't throw your you camera you just threw the camera all right so I'm so drunk and we just came from the party <sighs> oh my god it was so much fun I had such a good time. I did. I had such a good time. All the throwback, like R&B songs, couple of rap songs. We had so much fun. So, um, this guy I was in high school with and was like pretty good friends with um, in high school. DJs these parties once a month. They're like 
all R and B. Not all R and B. Okay, well it's a few rap songs, but mostly R and B. Keep the up tempo. Like I heard it was lit. I've never been before, and it's like an all R and B party, and we just had a freaking blast. Like they and played you, all the songs. We wasn't gonna go. We weren't gonna go. And you told me to go bowling, and I kept going because I knew you, you wanted to go. Did. Because I knew you wanted to go. I did. <laughs> Trying to get a hotel room. We did, and they don't have hotels where his party was, cause it's kind of like in the hood a little bit. So they don't have hotels over there. But and we got like a 45 minute drive home, which and is I not, did not drink, which is not good. As much. Yeah, 45 minutes is a long time, but it's okay, cause we had such a good time. Good morning. Good morning. Yeah, it's Sunday morning, and we are. Super tired, and I'm not super tired. I'm just had too much to drink last night. night. It's a little had a little too much to drink last night, but we have an Orange Theory class scheduled for 11:15, and we lose our class if we do not go. So um, Orange Theory is not cheap, so we're gonna go, and we're gonna push through it, and hopefully not puke our brains out. Facts. That's the plan. Facts. Now, why would you say you was doing with Sachin over? You said it was on the other screen. Why? It's on my other screen. I'm, I am. Supposed to be doing that, and then we. You ain't supposed to be working anymore. No you said you was done working. I am done. I'm done. Now. This is me and CC's conversation literally every night. She she goes through this thing where she'd be like, oh, I'm done working. Especially on Sundays. But she's never really done working because if I go look at her computer, she's doing something. So. Anyway, though, you gotta see where I'm working at. Oh, wait, oh, there we go. Oh. Yeah, you gotta see where I'm on. Well, some coming soon. But anyway, we are getting ready to end the night here. It is 11 15. We are getting ready to end the night here. It has been probably the quietest Sunday in the Bradley household in a very long time. Oh yeah, I didn't even tell them. <laughs> the girls did not come home today, which I already knew they weren't coming home today if we had to come pick them up. <laughs> so I called that yesterday. Um, but the girls did not come home. They went to a baseball game today with their grandma and grandpa and they stayed the night. So it has been me, Cece, and Mari all day long. We went out to eat and then we came home and it's just been quiet, y'all. I mean, like, quiet yet. Every, Mario's like, oh my God, I'm, the house is so quiet. <laughs> Don't know how to deal with this. <laughs> so, but he's in his room playing the game. Um, I'm about to jump on his website and look for some stuff. The wife is supposedly done, but she's editing because she's never done when she says she is. But it's going to wrap up another vlog for the week. Uh... Yeah, we're well into the summer now, so should be some fun things coming up very, very soon, guys. But that is going to end it for this vlog. So until next week, it's Mr. Bradley and them Bradleys checking out. Peace.